Here's my new lightsaber that I've been building for the last year. The whole uh, hardware and the software was developed by me. It's an Arduino powered lightsaber. It is ignited by a short press to the trigger button. Oh, you have to take out the kill switch first. Now it flashes, measuring the parameters of the battery. It is ignited by short press. It has movement detection. It has clash. And it also has the lock effect. You first press you make a short press for for the flash for the flash effect, but if you press it and hold it within half a second, it, it it activates the lock effect. It is turned off by a long press to the trigger key. It can, it can change colors and it has uh, quite a few menus. Uh, the menu setup is entered by a long press to the, uh, of the trigger button. And now I will stop talking and you will get the feeling how it works. Save and exit. Presets. Sound options. Blade options. Sensitivity options. Power options. Battery level. Power options. Sensitivity options. Blade options. Brightness. Color. Selecting a color from a predefined palette or mixing your own custom color. Brightness. Flicker. Choose the intensity of blade flickering. Brightness, color, brightness. Higher brightness is more visible in daylight, but also reduces battery life and results in warmer hilt. Lowering the brightness reduces the visibility, but increases play time. Color, currently, blue, blue, red, green, blue, ice blue. Purple, orange, yellow, white, custom color. In the custom color selection, you use your wrist rotation to select color hue and you tilt the saber to change saturation of the color. Once you find the color that you like, you just press the button. Blade options. To exit, you can change appearance of the blade visual effects. Okay, to exit a menu, you just hold the button, and uh, this is also if you are in a menu, then you use the button, long press to exit the menu, and if you are in the main menu, you use long press to save your selection. Now it uses the slightly bluish hue you cannot see it because the, of the of the camera but it is uh, slightly slightly bluish now we will change we will change it to a different color cancel and blade options color currently custom color rotate the wrist to browse through color hue and pitch the blade to change saturation. Click the button to select or hold it to cancel. Orange. Purple. Ice blue. Blue. Green. Oh, we are using the green blade. blade. Sensitivity of blade options. Okay, we can, Brightness. we can also change the flicker. Flicker. Currently. Low. High. Medium. Off, low, medium, high, blade options, you presets, 
Sound options. Volume. Sound font. Currently, default Jedi sound font. Default Sith sound font. Default Jedi sound font. Default Jedi sound font. Sound options. Blade options. Sensitivity options. Blade options. Sense power options. Battery low indicator. Warning signal when battery charge falls below 15%. Sleep. Battery low indicator. Sleep. The saber can automatically go to sleep if not moved for a specified period of time. However, if you don't plan to use the saber for more than several hours, you should use the kill switch instead to prevent battery depletion.